During the War of Spanish Succession, also known as Queen Anne's War, pirates were able to find legal employment as privateers for the government. A privateer was a private person or ship that engaged in maritime warfare under a commission of war. Basically, they were able to commit legal piracy. However, at the end of the war, many sailors and privateers were left unemployed. These unemployed people turned en masse to illegal piracy. Edward Teach, better known as Blackbeard, was an English pirate who operated around the West Indies and the eastern coast of Britain's North American colonies. Blackbeard can be seen here depicted on the Bahamas 1980 definitive series. Although little is known about his early life, it is believed he was a sailor on privateer ships during Queen Anne's War before he settled on the Bahamian island of New Providence, where the settlement of Nassau was born. Teach was a shrewd and calculating leader who relied upon his fearsome image to elicit the response that he desired from those whom he robbed. He was part of the Flying Gang, a group of ex-privateers who included notable pirates such as Charles Vane, Calico Jack Rackham, Anne Bonney and Mary Reed. Blackbeard is most famous for taking down one of his first ships called La Concorde, a French merchant ship, renamed to the now famous Queen Anne's Revenge. Nassau, with its massive shallow bay and its location to the many inlets and islands of the Bahamas, made it a perfect location as a pirate haven. It was here that the Republic of Pirates was established. Blackbeard's Tower is located at the eastern end of Nassau, just off Eastern Road. The tower was used as a lookout tower by the pirates in the 1700s. Although named Blackbeard's Tower, there is actually very little evidence the tower was used by Blackbeard. This postcard from Dexter Press from 1964 shows the tower during the peak growth period of tourism in the Bahamas. Although a historical landmark, today the tower lies among scrub and rubbish and can be difficult to locate. You can check out the channel Girl With Her Views where she visits what remains of the tower in 2018. The pirate takeover of Nassau literally halted trade in the Caribbean, forcing a prompt response by the British who needed to reclaim the territory to continue the lucrative triangle trade. The Pirate Republic would thrive until the King of England sent Governor Woods Rogers in 1718 to deliver an ultimatum to the pirates. Accept the King's pardon or accept Death.